Or another way of writing it would be a uh, summation of y i is equal to n into alpha hat plus beta hat into summation of x i. You know that's actually a better way of writing this equation. So this is the first equation that we've got. I'm going to label it as number one. And now we'll try to do another thing. We'll try to say that the derivative of uh, the square sum of the square of the error term with the respect to beta hat is supposed to be equal to zero. So what is the derivative of alpha error term square with respect to beta hat is going to be equal to the derivative with respect to beta hat of again this thing is going to come that is summation of y i minus alpha hat minus beta hat x i whole square. Now we got to do this over here. So what I can do over here is uh, since I'm doing it, doing the derivative with respect to beta hat, first I'll have this 2 over here. Then I'm going to have summation of yi minus x alpha alpha hat minus beta hat into xi into xi. It's because of this new, because uh, this beta hat has another xi with it. So this is going to be into xi. So uh, that is supposed to be equal to 0. Right, so this is something which is supposed to be equal to zero. Let's try to uh, break this to that side. So two into summation of uh, y i minus alpha hat uh, minus beta hat x i. So that into x i is supposed to be equal to zero. So this two gets eliminated here. Then I'm gonna have summation of y i minus alpha hat. Uh, minus beta hat xi into xi that is going to be equal to 0. So I'm going to break this xi into all the terms. That's going to be summation of xi yi minus alpha hat xi minus beta hat xi whole square is equal to 0. So if I kind of break this up again, it's going to be summation of xi yi minus alpha hat into summation of xi minus beta hat into summation of xi square, that is equal to 0. So from here I can say that summation of xi yi is equal to alpha hat summation of xi plus beta hat summation of xi whole square. So this is what I call the second equation, you know, which is going to help me to further calculate the value of beta hash and alpha hat, alpha hat in terms of xi and yi. So we have gotten these two equations here guys. That is summation of yi is equal to n into alpha hat plus beta hat into summation of xi. And we have gotten summation of yi xi to be equal to alpha hat into summation of xi plus beta hat into summation of xi square. Now we call both these equations as normal equations. Now these both equations are called normal equations. So what we're going to do now is, based on these two equations, we're going to be calculating the value of alpha hat and beta hat in the next video, right? So thanks for watching this video, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.